then it's just boy toy or something along those lines. Today's eviction was such a huge one. Hello guys, welcome back again to Everyday Life TV. Hope you guys are doing great. Trust you are doing fine, guys. Ebuka asked Soma about Angel and what's going on in that ship. Is it official? I asked them, what are they? Are they, are they a night time now? And Soma said, yes, Angel is his official girlfriend now in the house. Hmm. And Angel was staring at him like, okay. Ebuka was like, I heard that saying that I love you yesterday. So I hope you guys are official. And he said, yes. And he moved to Angel, asking Angel about um, why she called um, Adekunle Venita's boy toy. Is she, is she paying because of the pardon me or what happened? And Angel explained that. So even though that explanation wasn't really on, it was a non-resolved explanation anyways, but she said she wasn't paying. She was not, she was just like, she felt some type of way because Venita asked us to nominate Adekunle was last week, but she did not. She explained herself. And we did that one again. Ebuka moved to Venita, asking Venita about what is, what is she and Ade doing. And Venita said that Ade is the number one guy in the house. Ebuka was like, did you feel like um, Ade Kunle is your boy toy? And she said, no, that um, Ade Kunle is at peace. She was about to say that before Ebuka caught her off. And he also asked, Ebuka, um, what's his name? Ade Kunle, dad, do you feel the same way? That are you getting off an, an, an item now? And um, Ade Kunle and um, Venita raised up their hand. They were like, yeah, they concur. Ade Kunle concurs to what Venita said that. <laughs> He's at uh, Venita's boyfriend, not the boy toy, anyways. And we also see that, that reaction because we know that after March there will be drama. From the look of Venita, from Venita's face, like, hmm, she's gonna roast Angel. Yeah, she said Adekunle is a piece. I'm like, okay, he's now selling the official that Adekunle and Venita are on high time in the house now. Guys, Ebuka also asked um, Shola, that's Shouzi, Oma Shola, about like, who, who is this surprise to see in the house? And he asked, is it. Is it the one that he met in the house of people that, that he came with? And you said, okay, fine. Well, he was even reluctant to even answer, but they later on mentioned Kim. He said he's surprised to see Kim on the show. Everybody like, hey. And Kim was like, okay, okay. <laughs> Hi, guys. Ebuka is just here to, I don't know what he's trying to do. So he has been asking X's and Y axis questions. He also asked, um, Prince about what he feel about uh, Tolani Badge and Neil. Like, how did he feel seeing Tolani Badge and Neil together? Like, is it dumbfounded? And he said no. And he, he was like, are you shocked? Are you surprised? He said he's surprised that they are both together. But it is what it is. They are both grown house adults that make their own decision whatever, whatever they want to do. It's just do it. And Tolani Badge was just looking and smiling. So A lot of things went on. Ibuka also asked him about the conversation that Ilebaye said that. Um, Cross is not worth fighting for. And she was like, it's not a bad, back and forth situation. It's just a normal conversation. She felt like maybe um, Lebaye is high. That is why she sh she said such words because she's not. She was even shocked to hear that from her anyways. And Iki has decided to be a bad boy next week. So guys, <laughs> pray for your faith. Iki said he has been nice. He doesn't know why. Ibika asked him like, why are you being being soft this season? Was this time around, he was like, I doesn't know why, but maybe because after he, when he came to Nigeria, Nigeria has changed him. He's now a soft boy. He now has feelings, but he said by next week he'll go back to. Is um his old ways of you know vandalizing things. Let's just see, please. We want content, but we don't want toxicity. That's what, what I want. Ha guys, Tolani Bad has been evicted from the house. Tolani Bad also speaks about Neil being a sweet guy in outside the house because Ebuka was like the last time you spoke about Neil, we're like we're not interested in him, so it's just a normal like you're, you know, I'm not even attracted to the guy, but now we don't know you guys are not locking lips. And it was like, she was like, Yeah, I'll, doing the guy in the video outside the house, she has found out that he's such, he's such a sweet person that if you are not close to him, you won't know the kind of person he is. And yeah, he found him comforting. And yeah, and she also said that she will be the global, we should watch out for Tolani the DJ, the global DJ. Hmm, we can't wait to see Tolani the superstar, guys. They have a victim fraud. So today, there was a king size eviction. Tolani badge and fraud have been evicted from the house. Apparently, guys, fraud is the least person voted for for this week. But yeah, it was the second person to the house to be out of the house. That's making it the fifth housemate out of the house for this season. Papa Elena, that is fraud, has been evicted from the Big Brother house. He also told us to watch out for his real estate that is coming up soon. He said he's, he's, he's about launching or he's, he's about launching a hub too. I don't know a lot of things going on between the house. Ha, huh, guys, that's just how the eviction went. For today, I'll be right back with more updates. You have seen some, yeah, some, I cross has been moody after the eviction, but that will be a new news.
for another video guys thanks for always watching please if you have not subscribed please kindly click the like button and also subscribe them. guys feel free to share the video if you so wishes i'll be right back with more updates thanks for always watching guys thank you god bless you bye